what's up beautiful people listen to Arima. welcome to the channel today we're going to be checking this video and it's titled diddy is over the feds raids his home and his sons gets detained interesting it's no, it's no news that the feds raided diddy's homes and yeah i'm excited to check this one out to hear what they've got to say let's check it out hello everybody welcome to the impressive channel it seems like things are really hitting the fan for Diddy right now because two of his homes were raided by Homeland Security. His home in LA and his home in Miami were both raided and he is being accused of running a sex trafficking ring. Now his ex-girlfriend Cassie was the first one to expose his trafficking crimes. She actually sued him for all the heinous things he did to her and he quickly settled with her. Not only that, he was hit with another lawsuit by a woman who was allegedly violated by him when she was underage. Also, he was hit with a lawsuit by his ex-producer, Lil Rod, and he claims that Diddy runs a whole trafficking ring, which includes minors. Not only that, he was accused of having possession of illegal guns and drugs, and also he was accused of having hidden cameras in his home, and he would actually catch people doing sexual acts on camera and use it as blackmail to make them do what he wants them to do he basically is another jeffrey epstein and i feel like there are several jeffrey epsteins running around in the industry this is how they keep certain prominent figures political figures musicians entertainers under their control if they could get absolutely true there are lots of them that are in the industry so many and with Diddy being exposed or Diddy's um, home being raided, there are some people who would also not want their name to be um, attached to this or to be investigated, to be added to this. So they'll also want to make look for a way to not get dragged down so they don't get exposed. But again, this thing is weird with the, with the way lots of people just want to control things. But again, the truth is, will the truth ever come out? Because this is not like in the movies. Is this is real life we're talking about sometimes the truth might not come out and sometimes the truth might not show um show face because some people would rather take the truth to the grave or to their grave but again this gets all the more interesting and i sure know that if diddy yeah, get exposed or diddy get caught best believe if he's got the truth if, if he's gonna sh um spill lots of people will not want him to spill so it's gonna be interesting but yeah let's go on their control if they could get them on camera doing something crazy or if they could force them to do something crazy then they could use that as a way yes. to control them i honestly wish all of these culprits yes. would be exposed not True. just diddy but there's just so many of them who are just doing a lot of wild mm -hmm. reckless things even dan schneider from nickelodeon how he was accused of doing highly inappropriate and abusive stuff to these children who are on the mm. network he needs to be locked up too everybody out there doing dirt need to be locked up everybody but yeah people were saying that diddy fled his mansion and homeland security showed up they didn't find him but they did detain his two sons christian and justin which i think is really sad that diddy just left his children hanging like that i mean his children could have been in serious danger because if you know anything about homeland security they do not play i mean they show up there with their guns and their tanks it's very intimidating and they will attack if they feel like there's a hint of a threat um did he fled but it's not surprising it's not even shocking but again i don't think he will leave his children hanging knowing that this was much expected or they saw this coming because um i mean the children too would be aware so they might must have been preparing for this more so homeland security or the feds will not just go to raid people because it must have been well planned or thought of for weeks if not months and they already would have an inside man that knows what they um, knows where to go or what to look for because i mean they, it, it it doesn't just work work out work for them to just go and say oh they are just coming to show up more than likely, they have an insider or an informant that will tell them things, what to look for, where to go, who and who would be in the house or who and who would be, would be in the home or would be available. More so, the kids or the children would also maybe, may know 
that they are coming so they would also want to be present because maybe they might not also want to be dragged down with their father or their daddy maybe this is just speculation but again i'm just saying that maybe they were aware of this of the feds coming in but again i also wish that other people who are also involved in this or other people who do these things that their names are not mentioned other people should also be exposed not just didi because it looks like didi is just gonna look be the fall guy for lots of people and other people will go on to keep doing what they are doing but it's sad uh, but interesting as well let's go on like there's a hint of a threat so he left his children in harm's way and people said that he got on a jet and fled to a private island and they were tracking his jet however it seems like this could have been a diversion because diddy wasn't on the jet in fact he was found pacing outside of the miami airport so I think Diddy was trying to make a plan to escape the country without them being on his tail, but he was spotted. So we shall see what happens. And I know there will be a lot more updates by the time I upload this video. And I definitely am going to come back and talk more about it. So we shall see how this whole investigation unfolds. Hopefully no evidence is buried. We need to see all the evidence because what is done in the dark has to come to the light indeed what is done in the dark has to come out, uh, come out in the light but he fled using his private jets but he's not in the private jets he was caught or seen in miami but this gets all the more interesting because yo this looks like it was planned or well thought out it doesn't just look like it just up happened out of the blues because it's not in it it's two apart two homes that were raided the at the time i mean yeah he's a celebrity he's popular he might not be potentially in his house or in his home but again lots of things are not adding up was it tipped off but again now that they've raided his both homes or his two his two homes is the truth ever gonna come to light are they going to find evidence that is going to reveal the truth? Because, I mean, it's not just going to be Didi. If the evidence, if evidence eventually comes out, it's not just going to be Didi that will be going down. Lots of other people, names that lots of people will not even want to know would be revealed. Are people ready for all of this? Because this is going to be huge big but again another thing that i want to say is i hope they're not just going to bury evidence because things like this or people like this they move in circles and there are lots of people who will not want their names to be exposed or will not want to get dragged down but this is interesting it's even um it's interesting but it's not going to be weird and surprising coming from hollywood because i mean weird things do happen in hollywood and I wish everybody or people who are part of this would also be exposed. But this gets all the more interesting. And another thing that I just thought, for him to flee, that means they are up to something and maybe they found something. And somebody like Didi would know a lot, would know so much. This is actually so many thoughts running through. What is going to happen? What is the likelihood that... The truth is going to come to light or the evidence is going to be revealed or the names involved in this are going to be revealed but i'm sure tons of people have interesting things to share i really love your honest contribution what are your thoughts about um Didi's homes being raided by the feds and what are your thoughts about him fleeing the states do you think him fleeing the state do you think it is true or do you think he's somewhere hiding I really love your honest contribution. I'm sure tons of people have interesting things to share regarding this. You can share the useful information you think might be really helpful. Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe, and all of that stuff. And until next time, see you in the next video.